All right, here's a little treat for you, making keyways. So you know that you can easily get to making a keyway even with a, such a simple tool as a grinder. You can have CNC equipment to do this, but a grinder will do. Here's some videos of how you could do it, making keyways on the wiki. Okay, now it gets a little challenging. What about an internal keyway? All right, so for example, uh, making keywords here, I put a little dock, dock here. Look at this. Let's take a look at this. So here's an internal keyway. Well, how do you do that? Can't get a grinder in there. Well, actually you can. And this is the concept of a, of a through keyway, meaning that you grind this down from the outside and you have a keyway that goes all the way to the inside for an interior uh, keyway effectively done from the outside. No brooches, no parting tools, no CNC needed. This is a brute force way to do it. Uh, if you look at the source in FreeCAD, let me just walk you through this. FreeCAD 16. Open up. Okay, download this first. We'll click on the source, download it. This is right on the wiki. This is going to the inter this is what we're gonna use actually for heavy duty track drive for bulldozers and heavy tractors up to fifty thousand pounds of traction or starting with as little as a couple of thousand pounds of traction. But this is a 3D CAD, you can download it here. This is the, the through keyway concept. Download that. To the desktop. Go back to FreeCAD and open it up through QA Sprocket. So what's going on here? Uh, how do you make this? Well, you start with a with a coupler. This right there. Uh, you take it without the sprocket. With a grinder, just grind that through all the way. And there's instructionals on that other wiki page for how to do it. But the thing is, after you grind it, this is this was a structural integrity. But if you weld this this uh, dry sprocket on afterwards that completely reinforces your coupler again and for a DIY set screw without any machining just weld a nut here so by using welding you have completely firmed this coupler back up and note that I did not slip all the way through to leave some structural integrity here uh, but this is a quick DIY way to get uh, internal keyways uh, for heavy duty applications. Uh, this is actually quite easy for large applications or small. This, is, this here happens to be a two inch sprocket for a two inch shaft. Thank you. Hope you found this to be a little treat for the day.